Good afternoon, I'm Dan Godwin. Classes are canceled at Richland Middle School as police search for a man believed to be armed and dangerous. Police thought the man was held up in a house, but that has changed. This is happening right now in the 7,000 block of Bridges Avenue, not far from the middle school. Fox 4's Phil Alvarado is in the area of the scene. Phil, what started all of this? Well, Dan, it all started about 3 o'clock this morning when police uh, tried to pull over a man for suspicion of DWI. He ran from police, and then they thought uh, he was holed up in that house behind us. Uh, just in the last several minutes, they've determined that he is not inside. And if you take a look, uh, the house is right across the street from Richland Middle School, and that is why uh, police determined that, that they should cancel the classes for the day. A few minutes ago, uh, they fired some tear gas, and that's how they determined that he was not in there. Earlier, uh, before the tear gas, they fired what's called a sock rounds, a kind of a bean bag. And if you listen closely, you can hear when that's happening. That's the house where police say the suspect had uh, been in since about 3.30, or at least they suspected that. Uh, they fired those sock rounds, and that was enough to cause a man and a woman who were, uh, police believe, live in that house to come out. Police don't know what their relationship is to the suspect, if any. Uh, police say that they uh, tried to pull over this man for suspicion of DWI. He ran from police, crashed his car, and ran on foot. Uh, he was discovered outside a convenience store. He ran again from police, and that's when officers thought that uh, he pulled what looked like a gun and pointed it at police. In the beginning, police asked the Birdville ISD to delay classes at Richland Middle School. I brought my son to school at 7.30 this morning, and as soon as we pull down our normal street that we go down, it's, you know, it's roadblocked. And so we went around the roadblock and got in front of school, and when we pulled up in front of school, the um, teachers were out there telling us that there was a hostage situation behind the school and that school was going to be delayed for two hours. That turned into the call to cancel classes at Richland Middle School for the rest of the day. Police uh, were saying all along that uh, the district at uh, all the other schools, that those students were uh, really safe and had nothing to worry about. Now, one of the things that police have determined is that the car that they pulled this man over that he ended up crashing was a stolen car. So he was on the run since 3 this morning and apparently still on the run. Dan? All right, thanks very much, Phil Alvarado in Richland Hills.